All right, y'all already know. So Keyshawn Davidson, prospect at 135 pounds, who just came off a victory uh, last week in his hometown of Norfolk, Virginia, is now calling out superstar boxer Javante Tank Davis. Looking at his article from Boxing Scene, and he's has expressed that he wants to fight Javante Tech Davis. Next, quote, I want to fight him, bro, because he's been tricking the boxing game for too long. He makes shit look better than, than what it is. He makes shit look good. He also goes to say, resume, resume what? What kind of resume has he got? He ain't got no effing resume, man. He don't got no damn Sugar Ray Leonard's on his resume. He don't got no Marvin Hagler. No real deal fighters like that. He got fighters. We all know he's going to win. I'm not trying to hear none of that. And also, uh, to add on to this, Keyshawn Davis is good friends with Tank. I mean, Javante, not Javante. Shakur Stevenson. They homeboys and all of that, right? So let me just let me just let, let, let me break this down. Keyshawn Davis is third is 13 and 0, but don't nobody really know who he is. If you ask the casual fan who is Keyshawn Davis, nobody's going to know who he is, number one. Number two, come on now, this is boxing. We all know Bob Arum is not going to let that happen. Why would Bob Arum throw away his investment, a 13-0 fighter, for a Javante Tank Davis? Because you pretty much feeding him to the wolves at that point. And while I agree Tank Davis really ain't fought nobody on his resume, he's, he has a bigger name than you, and he's fought better fighters than you have. And then another thing, why, why would Javante Tank Davis fight Keyshawn Davis? For what? I mean, listen, if, if, if it were to happen, cool. But come on now, we all know that that's not, that we all know it's not going to happen. It's just not. It ain't going to happen no time soon. Keyshawn Davis, he would have to at least win a belt, build his name up to where if you walk down the street, you ask people, hey, you heard of Keyshawn Davis? Who? Who? You know, and there's no disrespect to the young brother. Look, if he fight Tank and win, cool. But all this calling out, all this WWE type shit, we all know that it's not going to happen. It's just not. You know, so what if so if Keyshawn, dude, if you want to get your yo, 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 uh, if you ever want to fight Tank, and it'll probably be two, three years down the line. You know, Tank Davis claims he got a hit list. Maybe you can get added on there. What you need to do is, you want to call him out right now? Cool, but you need to get your social media game up. You need to build your fan base up. You need to have some more impressive fights to where the casual fan can see it and then make it to where they demand a fight. But right now, people want to see Tank Davis fight the Shakur Stevenson, the Devin Haney's, the Teofimo Lopez's at 140 pounds. I haven't heard one person calling out uh, Keyshawn Davis versus Javante Tank Davis fight. It's just not going to happen, not at this moment. You know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Y'all can call me a hater and all of that, but it's just no, 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 nobody's gonna look at that fight and say, "Man, Keyshawn has a chance." I just he he he's still a young prospect. So I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.